We in them, we winning, gang. We in them, we winning, gang. We in them, we winning, gang. Hey, hey, gang. Ah, look at that split it on. I want to tell you what happened at the post office today. Today when I was at the post office, now please remember this message won't resonate for everyone. But um, we're talking about you guys. If you're coming across this message, there's a reason. Because you got money coming towards you, okay? I was standing in the line at the post office today and this guy right beside me, behind me, he goes, can we all have $5,000? And then this lady, it was like, it was like some sort of, like some type of show that was like scripted or something. <laughs> Just when I walked in, I swear. Because <clears throat> the lady on the other side of the, the counter who was working there, she said, absolutely, yes, for everyone, yes. <laughs> and I don't know, like, they were just role-playing right there in front of me. And I said, hmm. anyway, if you're seeing this, you could be about to win $5,000 or just get $5,000. Yeah? Maybe somebody's about to give $5,000 away. <laughs> Somebody could be about to raise $5,000. <laughs> Raise the bar. Let's go. Right? This could even be on social media for some of you. We're about to get... Five, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Okay. Like, look at this. It's, it's coming out again. $5,000 or something more. Right? Some of you got a lump sum of money coming towards you. But this specifically, since the guy said that today, I think it's 5000 Boom. Straight to you, boo. Ain't nothing messing around about it. Some of you have recently... Um, I'm going to say, been indecisive about walking away from somebody, from something, could be a job, a person, you could keep going back to that shit, hold up, hold up, this could be a friend or a family member that you feel is bad for you, it could be someone that you're dating that you feel is like no good, are you trying to like emotionally detach from them? It's weird because, like, at the same time, this person make you feel calm, huh? <laughs> planning some kind of marriage, planning some kind of commitment. Maybe you've spoken about commitment with this person. Shit. Whew, and I get it for some of you. You got a lot of options, especially those of you in that divine masculine energy. <clears throat> a lot of people fighting to get in your energy gang. <laughs> Some of you could be manifesting a new home or a new home. You've had a dream of your new home. You've had a dream of living somewhere else or being around um, <clears throat> different kind of people. Uh, maybe some of you are a little bit stressed about the home situation. Don't you worry, gang. You got jobs coming, jobs on the way, wish fulfillment, right? Shit, you got financial freedom coming to you, gang. This is you got coming to you. All right. Plus this $5,000 extra. Right? Yeah, some of you are, some of you got childhood wounds, you know, child, we got reprogramming to do from childhood, right? What's your relationship like with money? If it ain't good, if it ain't sexy, if it ain't romanticized, what the fuck kind of relationship is it? What kind of relationship you got with yourself? Yeah, I know, Sean. You gotta be loving on the things that you wanna be love, that you want, want to have loving on you, right? <laughs> That's right. <clears throat> Some of you may have taken some big hits <clears throat> or big losses when it comes to business. All right, some of you are very risky motherfuckers with the things you do for work for some of you. All right, or risky with your investments. <laughs> but you like, it's like you're like divinely guided at the same time, right? <laughs> okay, I'm getting some of you. <clears throat> Some of you, <laughs> right, you got this talent, you got anxiety about it, you could want to speak, you could, like, this could be public speaking, this could be some kind of musical talent, it could be an artistic talent, it could be just, like, you, something that you're passionate about. This is what I'm getting, like, something you could be kind of learning, you may not be an expert at it, but some of you be, like, in your head about this shit, right, you could have a relationship that's sort of, like, one-sided, <laughs> Maybe it started as like wish fulfillment, but it just feels like there's just pain. You know, this person has stabbed you in the back ten times, told ten lies, gonna fuck their head up ten motherfucking times. How many times? Ten times. 
How many times? Ten times. Stang telling that shit ten times. <laughs> Alright, gang. Some of you indecisive about a fucking relationship right now. You know what I'm saying? But you're holding on. But I feel like the hopes and dreams have been crushed, you know? Deep down. This could have just been a physical connection. Right? And you're thinking about, is this really love? Is this love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. What is love? Yeah, we got that freaking Wheel of Fortune and the Empress out here, gang. I think some of you got some obsessive secret admirers. Look at this shit. You got some obsessive secret admirers. <laughs> some of you empresses out there, dang. You looking too fine, girl. <laughs> you looking too fine. Oh, shit. I got ink all over my hand. <clears throat> but, yeah. Oh yeah, some of you got a freaking new person coming in quick. This could be a water sign. Heavy, heavy. You could be communicating with one right now. It feels like some of you are just focused on other things. Like, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, you, you on some shaman shit. You on that G shit, that G shit. What's that? The baby genius shit, G shit. <laughs> the genius shit, G shit. The goddess shit, the god shit. Hey, where the gods at? Sacred knowledge, Netflix. Man, you guys, you're like movie stars on earth. That's what you gotta understand. That's what you gotta understand. Hmm. Some of you got this evil lady out there who's really good at controlling people's emotions, right? They got this hydrokinesis ability. They lie and they can control emotions, right? They can manipulate. It's almost like they can manipulate the flow of your motherfucking emotions or something. Where did they learn that voodoo? Oh my god. We got DNA activation. Shit, this could be somebody that is like activated or clairvoyant. What? Oh, this could be you. What? Oh, no. We got somebody that from Sirius B. Let's go, B. <sighs> yeah, we got money hungry motherfuckers. These money hungry motherfuckers, this evil woman, she money hungry. She money hungry. She lying to you, gang. Look at this shit. Evil woman lied to you, fuck. Man. You got serious B. Look at Fuck, man. What's gonna happen, spirit? <laughs> I get like lots of bubbles in a pool of disguise. Probably say, fucking love a bubble bath. Right, somebody wants some justice. Alright. You could have a secret guardian. Someone wants justice for something that could have been done to your body. Oh, shit! The police want some motherfucking justice, right? Or someone's got some pretty freaking heavily surveilling ancestors around here. Shit, maybe some of you don't realize your ancestors surveilling heavy, heavy on this shit. They want some motherfucking justice for something that was done to your body, All right? Anunnaki, shit, motherfucking, motherfucking Anunnaki. Maybe she could go way back under parallels. Right, Anunnaki used you. Motherfuckers, Anunnaki used you. <laughs> Anunnaki used you. Help is coming. Fuck, man, what the fuck did the Anunnaki do? <laughs> Apparently the Anunnaki created us though. And we have to pay our respects. Our due respects for the creation of us. To them though. If we ever cross them in the astral. Right? Maybe some of us got Anunnaki family. I miss you. Maybe some of us was on the good side. Shit. And yeah, somebody's got powerful gifts. Could be EFT tapping. You could do EFT tapping. Gay. That's some G shit. That's G shit, gay. That is some G shit, some G shit. Now tell me how y'all fucking glitching out the game. 
Ah, oh, look at this. We got the Ace of Pentacles one more time. <laughs> Red. Look at these little keys. Oh, my Lord. Oh, we got the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody got it. Ooh. Ace of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles. This could be money coming in from something that you're passionate about. <laughs> Something's is bringing in wish fulfillment for your gang. We got the Nine of Cups, like what? Ten of Pentacles in the body. It's about to be happy time for you, gang. Surprise! <laughs> That's what I feel like saying. Surprise! Oh! Someone's gonna be throwing a surprise party. What? Surprise! Judgment. <gasps> Some of you got a brand new relationship coming in. Oh my lord. The Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups, and the Strength. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't deal with it. They're so adorable. But yeah, I've been playing with my uh, coloring out uh, things. So yeah, we got Ace of, Ace of Cups. I'm telling you, this stuff is adorable. Okay. Strength. Somebody got healer cards. All right, we're going to leave it there. Uh, thanks for watching this, 1155. Let me know if it resonated for you, and I'll see you in the next one, gang. Fuggy says peace.